Hello everyone, welcome back to Ark Survival Ascended. This is episode 9, I believe. Uh, I just wanted to get to give you guys a good look at the uh, the camo, or the, what is it called? The ghillie suit? It's really cool. I really like how they made it this time. Go ahead and go show you guys. I did go ahead and get the uh, the male otter, like I was saying in the, in the end of the last one. I didn't go ahead and find it, but it did take me about three other otters Latin, the there was supposed to be another one here but when i was gonna tame it it actually got eaten by some so i i have three male or three females and then one male so we finally have a mating pair um but yeah i just wanted to show that off i have some uh, metal cooking here i did make some polymer some oh yeah so i did make make a bunch of furnaces as well i made a bunch of uh, ac units my bad some AC units, but other than that, I don't think I've done too too much. Oh yeah, and I also wanted to make uh, notice that while I was looking for these, can you guess what baby I found? I found a baby Ceratosaurus. It was a level 140 Ceratosaurus. Went ahead and uh, tamed it up, and now it's mine. I don't have to put up, but it has a hundred percent. What is it called? Imprint. Yeah, imprint because. Uh, it was going slow enough where I could uh, imprint in it four times before it actually became an adult. But he's pretty freaking cool. I mean, he's, he's a Ceratosaurus. He's a 140. He's not shit. I named it Holly. I don't know. Uh, Baryonyx Rousey. And I found it. I found the Ceratosaurus where I found uh, that Rousey um, Baryonyx. I found his Dermophodon. It was just kind of stuck there in the corner, so I just kind of tamed it. Took one arrow. And didn't really do anything. In this episode, I really, I really want to get into to getting making the um, the eggs. Ready, buddy? Must be happy as hell. <laughs> Look at it, the numbers all switching. Damn, all three at the same time, boy. God dang. Got curious. <laughs> Can you How can you say no to that face? So cute. We'll give him some privacy here. Just wait for the sound to come on. We'll move the ladies upstairs once uh, once they're finished finish mating with uh, that otter. So we can get their babies in a nice place where I can concentrate on all the babies. Oh, I also, I also uh, actually picked up a trough. So now I have a trough now. So I have fish for the uh, otters and the baryonyx, meat for everything everything else that doesn't eat. Well, it's a combination of both, really. And berries for the herbivores. So now I have a trough, so every single animal in here doesn't really have too much food in their inventory. I do want to get some scuba gear. Maybe take the baryonyx down low. So they just finished. So we'll disable mating on them. Gestation is 10 minutes. Right? 10 minutes. Okay, ladies. Let's go ahead and go upstairs. Hustle, hustle, hustle. Let's turn the lights in here. Oh, you guys are so cute. Oh my god. <laughs> so we got 10 minutes, 9 minutes on that one. And we'll start incubating all the other eggs. I don't think it matters too much where we put them. It just matters that we don't eat them. I like to spread them out just because sometimes they spawn in right next to each other and I don't like that. So, two minutes and a minute 15. Okay. Shit, we could have like. Oh shit, I need to go get some meat. We'll just get this meat for now. It could be hatching. Ah! Okay. Oh, double bear, double parasaur, double parasaur. <laughs> That's so cute. Okay, we got a double parasaur here. Holy shit, they're growing fast. Double, we got double triplets. Baryonyx is regular. Just him. Damn, these boys need to be taken out already. Okay, so let's. Follow you, follow me, and then you follow me. And 
Oh shit, everything is falling. Oh no. Oh no, 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 oh no. Oh my god, double again. We're getting twins all over the place. They're growing a lot faster than I thought they would. Where's that berry at? Oh, there he is. Hey, come here. Come here. Alright, fuck it. Let's get them all outside then. I didn't think they were gonna grow up this fast. Shit, now I can't fit because they're too big. Come on, guys. What the fuck is happening? Okay, so first off, this one, and then this one, and then this one, and then this one. Cool, we can make the whole set. Let's go. We can go in the water, boys. We'll go ahead and take Mike here for a spin. He's never been to the ocean. Shit, I've never been in the ocean. Okay, let's put a scuba gear on. We'll just put the metal ones on. Okay. Very nice. I do understand that the uh, Baryonic has a uh, has an has a oxygen tank, so we're not going to spend too much time here. But I do like what I'm seeing so far. What is all this stuff? I'm going to have to tell the Barry to. Stay with me here. So now it's gonna float up. There you go. What is this stuff? It's pretty cool though. I don't know what it is, I don't know why it's fluorescent like that, but it's pretty cool. shifted here. We're not too far away. But we do have what we need, so I don't want to spend more time than we have to out here. I do want to explore a little bit lower, but uh, I don't know. With the berry, I don't know, like with the whole... Maybe I'll get a, a basilosaurus. I'll get Papa, I'll get a bas basilosaurus to explore the, the very low ports of the, of the ocean. Just because of the the eels and stuff, that's what I was trying to find, the eel, jellyfish, all that sort of stuff. Good job Tyson, we got a lot of fish now. Go ahead and put this in the uh... preserving bin, there you go, fish. Go check out what we're gonna need for the actual mission here. So the first one we just need the artifacts, that's it. Artifacts, and then for this one we need 
Sarco, Titanoboa, Sauropod, RG, all that other stuff. But also the ones over here. And then we can go and then we just need more and more of each of the other ones. Okay. Alright. Well, it's good to know. Should probably check that spino. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Spinos picked off a little bit more than they could chew. i probably do the baryonyx right now, since I can. If you guys hear a little bit of a rustling in the in the background, that's just somebody outside with a moving truck. They, they have the little gate out the moving truck, the back of it, but they're messing around with it, trying to get it level or whatever. I don't know what they're trying to do. So if you guys hear like a little rustling in the background, that's probably just that. But yes, let's go ahead and do the baryonyx. Let's hatch them up here and then move them downstairs as soon as we can. So, we'll go ahead and drop them. And then as soon as we can, we'll go ahead and lower him down to the, to the lower level because we don't want him getting stuck in here and starting to suffocate and die. I really wish we had tech... Tech dinos. Finding a tech, a tech rex would be nice would have been nice. When I used to play uh, on Xbox I would have this uh, I would have this Tech Rex black blacked out Tech Rex with a blue hue on it on the globe. Oof, so nice. So so nice. But we're not gonna talk about that. We're talking about this baryonyx that's about to hatch up right in front of us. Boom! Level 215 tech uh, baryonyx. Not tech baryonyx, just regular baryonyx. Well, we'll save it for now. Because he's growing quickly. So we need to get him out of here. You guys follow me, right? I need you to follow me like real close though, because we could be cutting corners here. give you some fish so you can grow up to be nice and oh you're already just feeding from the trough are you yep he's already just eating from the trough. he's too he's too old for me already who's he got that from oh it just looks like his mom like straight like his mom oh sorry i didn't mean to walk you over here i mean you'll be close to your pants that's fine He's got the green stripes, got it from his mom. Uh, well, he pretty much just looks identical to his mom. He's got the blue hue. Yes. Oh. Well, is he blue or is he... No, no. He looks exactly like his mom. Or his dad. No, his dad. Ha! <laughs> yeah. That's how it happens sometimes. Oh, well, it is, a, it is, a, it is a boy. Never mind. Yeah, that's not... It's not really, really that rare for the son to look like a boy. For the son to look like a <laughs> the dad. What am I saying right now? Okay. I think that's fine for a little moment. We do need to get back as fast as we can to the berry. Uh, I don't think it has very much of a window to get fully imprinted. Okay, 12 seconds, all right. What are you gonna need? Are you gonna need a walk? Are you gonna need specific food? What are you gonna need? These don't be expensive, because this is gonna lose out on a lot of stuff. Cooked prime meat. Nice, gotta love that. I don't have cooked prime meat, dog. Really gonna ask for that right now? That's so. I don't think it's gonna reach, but oh, actually, I should probably cook all that prime meat. <clears throat> Just in 
case he wants it again. I don't really need that much meat cooked, so I'm just gonna stop that. It's the raw prime meat that I was really trying to cook. And fuck up this cereal. Fifty percent. It's like the other one. That's fine. We'll call him Tyson Jr. Since he is a man. There we go. It's Tyson Jr. right there. I'm gonna saddle for him. Go. We'll slowly move across to the. Smithy or fabricator. I always forget the name of this fucking thing. Fabricator. Actually, he got the the blue. He got the the base color and stripes of his mom. But the underbelly of who? He looks like his mom. Hey man. Or who look? Who am I confusing with? No, no, never mind. <laughs> it's still his dad. I just, I just put him on the other side. Okay, so we got Tyson. We should probably get the RG now. Let's hope we get twins. Or maybe, I don't know. I know we should hope to get twins or not. Three, two, one. Twins! Oh, but he's got that little cute tip on his head. Follow me a little bit closer, because he's not going to follow me that close. Your first flight, you saw that? Pelagornis, you saw that? That's fine right there, sir. You can stop. I'm pretty sure these are. this one's going to be like the, the Baryonyx. It's going to need two implantations, so we'll come back in about a minute and two. Let's give some more wood to my furnaces, because they're all running out of wood. What are you gonna want as an imprint? Cut off. Perfect, that's what I like. That's what I like, that's what I like. Okay. Perfect. We got another three minutes to work with. Go. Let's see. Wants to go on a walk with me. Perfect. I love a walk. Jesus Christ, they're really moving that shit. Hell yeah. Let's go. Nice. Okay, perfect. So now it's fully imprinted. And you can stop following me now. I just gotta wait for you to be fully tamed up. And you're the offspring of who? Uh, A-tip and recess. And you're a male, so you're gonna be Rhesus Jr. I think that's how you spell Rhesus. Let's see. Now we need to get you a saddle. Let's get you a saddle, good boy. Okay. Saddle is a little bit more high, a little bit more thatch. Alright. Thatch is not a problem. Boom. Welcome to the family, Recess Jr. We'll upgrade your weight while we're at it. We're not gonna use them anymore, so let's go ahead and retire Perp. Because Perp, I mean, not that Perp did anything, right? But we'll retire him anyways. He, he made us learn on, on what 
the Ceratosaurus is, so you know, it deserves a good, uh, good retirement. So, we'll retire him here next to Santavis. Santavis a lot more achieving, or achieved, but it's fine. Just retired anyways. Hall of Fame. Should probably try to find a good Rex. Because if we don't go for Megatheriums, because Megatheriums are gonna do pretty well, but I feel like Rexes would benefit us both in and out of boss battles. So I don't know which one to do. Okay, I just figured something out of the Megatheriums. They're very good at ca gathering chitin, which is something we need, actually. So I might just go for a fucking Megatherium. Um, we are gonna have to go to the to the redwoods, I believe. The redwoods is really only only place they really spawn at, or the cold biome too. The cold biome as well is where they spawn. Hmm. Which one would be less less work? I feel like the cold biome, honestly. We could t we could take the sarrow. We could take the sarrow for its first. Uh, yeah, fuck it. Let's take the Sarah out for a spin, which uh, we should have enough materials in recess. We'll make an extra two just in case we fuck it up, which we shouldn't. But you know, everything happens over there, so let's be prepared for the worst. Okay. So we got what to trap it. Now we need something to knock it out, which we have our Mastercraft bow. 33. So to knock one out, we would need about 40 each. And we're gonna use pretty much, I mean, we're gonna try to find raw prime meat. So it's gonna take nine, and we shouldn't need any. But, like I said, everything always goes wrong. So let's take an extra 100, load this into the Serato. We'll actually take the rhino saddle just in case we do find one over there. If we're gonna try to, if we find a rhino there, we'll try to try to make a big pen for it. So we'll take the rest of this, Got a little bit more of these. Actually, I think we can carry all of it. Perfect. Ethereum. Cementing paste, okay. I got you. I might not got you. <laughs> okay. Oh, there he is. Gotta go. Okay. Another Megatherium. Megatherium? Megatherium. Uh, the rest of the cementing paste can go in here because that's where it normally gets used up in. Ah, the cementing paste. Got some more pearls. Rare flower gets put in here. Yep, two saddles. We can throw this. And we're fine. Alright, let's go. Where do we want to go? Let's go... Well, they're all over the place, really. They're all over the place here. But the closest point is going to be right there. So let's get to that point. And then we'll scatter from there. Let's go. I don't know if we should take the coast or not. But he's going to be pretty quick. So we should probably take the coast until we're 100% speed. It breaks rocks for some reason. Even I don't understand that. Okay. So we've got here. Perfect. I hope this thing doesn't get affected by the Uranus. 
That really suck. Cause there's a bunch here. I didn't think about that until I just got here. Oh, it's a dinosaur here. Not that I forgot that the titanosaur was here, but I forgot that he was so close. I didn't think I was this close to him. Whoa. Oh my god, that's so like, I don't know, human? Let's just look around, I guess. Of the rocks. If we mine it with the stone axe, it'll make stone. I don't want stone because stone is heavy and flint is not, so let's break it with the pickaxe. And there, before that, before we put these, we'll actually pick them up because we need to put the art, we need to put the rhino in here first. So now we can actually add the, the trap. Easy peasy lemon squeezy, baby. I was only slightly bit nervous, but that is pretty, uh, pretty normal when you're when you're dealing with this big of a beast. I mean, this thing could fuck me up. So let's look around for some berries. We'll switch this to stone arrows in case we do need a fire. He will be following me. Uh, what's your stance at? Medium? That's fine. The Woolly Runner will just stay there and, and starve tame. I'm just gonna look around for some berries. Alright, Mammoth, do you mind? Said it's gonna take 15, just in case it starts attacking it, and put it on passive. So we can shoot this without any issue. One, two, three. There you go. He is down. Perfect. 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 Exactly what I wanted. Now it's just a waiting game. Let's name her. What should we name her? We'll name her at the house, because I don't I can't think of anything right now. And the uh, Carno is swimming. Yes, I know girl, you wanna be let out. I understand. But you gotta give me a sec, because there's something on the other side that would kill you. And I 
don't want that to happen. If you just pick up all the stone foundations, it picks up everything else for you, so you don't have to manually do everything. I'm gonna get this explorer note with this guy. Or this girl, sorry. this dinosaur okay so stamina we definitely have to upgrade weight probably not uh, melee damage for sure so we'll do 7 14 21 so we'll do seven points and health we'll do what is good stamina like 600 maybe Do 600 for now and then half and half here. That'll be help. Um, encumbered. That was it for us. I legit thought that was, that was the end of us. That was it. I thought that was it. Did you guys think it was it? Because I thought it was it. Thinking about going all across the beach. Maybe not. I thought the, uh, I thought the intersection between those three points were a little bit closer. I'm, I'll just go up. I knew I was fast, but I didn't think I was that fast. That zero, that zero on max speed is a lot faster though. I'm so happy we have a Willy Rhino now. If we can get another one, that'd be sick. Get your little mating. A little mating buddy. Uh, where are you? Female? Female. So we need to find a male. If we're to find a mating pair over there. But let's go ahead and go with Rhesus. This is the one that has everything that we're gonna need. Even some petroleum jelly or some hemoglobin. So, alright, it's perfect. Let's go. This looks like a bush flying. A bush flying on a bird.
Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one right there. Right there, I'm level 120. Let's go ahead and hit that one. After taking some pictures with him um, for our thumbnail, because I, I figured this this would be better for the thumbnail since we're gonna do this for the most part. Uh, I'm gonna go get another one right now, or I'm gonna try to at least. So uh, I'm gonna just take a little break and then I'll be right back. It'll be like nothing if I. It's like a, it'll be like if I never took a break for you guys, but it's, it'll be like a couple hours for me. Cause Jesus Christ, that was very stressful. I need a little break. Be right back. end up dying I need him to run even though it, it probably won't matter because there's something's killing us but I would like to think that I gave him the best chance to survive by running we have what to keep it knocked out we have if we need to smelt something we have something to keep it in we should probably do this too two four six so we can take it off so that's fine um, we have six we have ten we have something to keep it in there while lock it and then we'll shoot it we have to, to shoot it our and our bow is good uh the prime meat okay let's go Hey guys, just wanted to pop in real quick. 
Uh, we found a level 145 male mammoth. We need a male for the two females we have at home. But it's just so bloody that it would die if we were, if we even tried to tame it right now. So I'm going to leave it here. I know where it's at. Uh, I'm going to mark it on my map and then come back and hopefully it's a little bit more less crispy. And we'll be able to tame it. But for now, we'll leave it here and we'll uh, we'll continue the search for a megatherium or a woolly rhino. Just wanted to update you guys because I found this. It was fighting a bunch of wolves, so it started getting bloody. Alright, perfect. Well, not perfect, but I found a level 100 female. And the one we found was a level 120. Oh, shit! Never mind. <laughs> I swear to God that was not scripted. Holy shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, anyway. We got a 130 female right here female male we gotta clear this area so we can put that trap there put this bear trap down all right let's see if we can shoot it down this, uh, yeah come on I'm down here oh shit Come on, come on, come on. Hell yeah. Okay. Alright, perfect. There you go. No, 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 no. Ugh. I thought you were going to start hitting. Okay. Alright, perfect. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Five. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. Perfect. Absolutely perfecto. Now let's get that. Uh, let's get this mammoth to come down here. Oh shit, I ate him. Well, let's hit this, uh, megatherium then. I hope you drop, uh, I hope you, I hope you drop Rob Prime me. Oh, it was a female anyways. Never mind. Wait. Oh, hold on. Oh, fuck. I might have fucked up royally. Do we need a male or a female? Oh shit, hold on. Yep. Uh, I already had a male. I need a female, which is why I looked at that female 100. Shit. I don't have any fucking. No. Oh. oh nice, I just fell in the fucking cave now. Damn it, should we? I mean, we should, because it's already knocked out. I got two pieces of prime meat from that. Contain me with raw, with raw meat. It's not really that serious. Oh my god, the UD is so close. I'm gonna kill this Anki just in case they attract to it or they uh, 
they, f they aggro on it. Come on, come on, come on. No, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Right Where did they grab? Where did they aggro on? Mm, what that all for Carnos? Mm, down. <sighs> Fuck. Nice. trying to tame this level 100 because we still need a female and now we're gonna have to tame her somehow uh, without a large bear trap I don't know how the fuck we're gonna do that but actually I think I oh maybe let me see Let's see if this will work Nothing aggro to it, right? Okay. Oh shit. Two. Three. Fuck. Ah, I keep missing. There you go. God damn it. <laughs> this motherfucker. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> Son of a bitch psyched me out. We're, need, we're gonna need more trank arrows. to flee and then I'm gonna run to the Baryonyx. Go, 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 go. Huh. And then passive. Craft some more. Ow. 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 Pretty good little turn there. <laughs> He's pissed. So fuck. Cryopods were still in the game. I forgot. No, I forgot, and I was 
led to believe that they weren't in the game anymore, but they are. I don't know why I haven't made those yet. Fuck. I'll make those whenever I get home. That would have been that would have made it a lot easier to do this. Let's see if we can make at least two for these two guys. Cryo pod. What do we need? Crystal? I know where to find it. Here. Oil, I know where to find it. Metal ingot is the only one where I'm like, eh. But we can only smelt it. Oh yeah, if you guys hear a little bit of water dripping, that's just someone showering in my house. So, disregard. Alright, run. Run. Ow. Piss off, fucking bitch. Ah! I got some oil right here. There should be some crystal around here. And metal I can find. Oh look. These are the motherfuckers I want to kill. But, to get the most out of them I need to get... Some... A bat. I need to get a bat. Am I riding a fucking mammoth right now? Sir, why have you just picked me up? It's hella disrespectful. Oh my god, of course. The sword does better. What the fuck? There is some crystal. How many can I make with just the crystal I have? I have nine crystal. How much crystal do we need for? Oh, I don't even have enough for one, bro. What the fuck? Uh, okay. I need to find crystal. I think we found the uh, entrance to the... Uh, that scared me. We should actually take care of these in case we do get knocked off. Or that we don't have already animals trying to fuck us up. Oh look! <laughs> we ran into some some crystal. Let me fuck. Oh I was running past crystal. Oh my god. Come here you pieces of shit, you wanted to fight me. Fuck yeah. Have some fake ass. Funk ass. Oh, yeah, forgot. Okay. Well, let's make a touch one then. Got that fire going, baby. I just gotta wait for it to smelt. While it smelts, I think we'll grab a little more. Check on this uh, metal. Perfect. Got ten pieces. Let's pick this up. Pick this up as well. And head to the nearest... Uh, nearest beacon. That's pretty near. Ow. Alright, we need to hurry this up. We can make four. And now we have cryopods. And my game just crashed. Fuck. Come on, bro. Uh, where's my gilly shit? Hmm. 
Where is where's where's my ghillie stuff? I'm just gonna pretend I didn't see that. Um put it here. <laughs> I miss that sound. Oh, come on. Are you serious? Not again, bro. Fuck. I'm gonna complain about it all the whole way, please. No, 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 no. Oh my god. Alright guys, we're back home, uh, I want to trek back home alone, or we're not recording it because Jesus Christ kept crashing on me, but uh, we're finally home, we made it with Mike, with Tyson, so um, one thing I was going to do was set out my cryopods, but you need a cryo fridge, now you need a cryo fridge to even pop them out, so uh, I went ahead and got the materials for a cryo fridge from my fabricator and we're gonna go to either a drop or the <coughs> obelisk whichever is closer uh, is that coming down? And there it is there's the drop Got a Pulpinoscorpus. Pulpinoscorpus. We're good, we're good, we're good. We're good. And let's not remove that one because then we lose the. Uh, we we'll lose the supply drop. Okay. There you go. It runs on electricity, so I just have to put it inside the base, really. Let's go and put it right. Oh, five minutes, okay. So you gotta wait five minutes as well. Fuck me. <laughs> okay, so let's see if we can uh, go ahead and take these guys out. I wanna take out the female first, so it'd be this one, right? Yeah, the one on the left. So it'd be four. There you go. Jesus, she's big. Alright guys, I think that's going to finalize this episode. If you would like to see more, um, go ahead and consider subscribing and liking this video if you did like it. And uh, other than that, like I said, I appreciate you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.